Well, no, like we live. I don't expect nobody to be here. We're, we're live. Mm-hmm. And uh, <laughs> how you doing there, Jamel? I didn't even expect nobody to be here. <laughs> Jamel is here. Okay. How you doing, Jamel? Well, Jamel, we're here because um, Angel Snub Number Seven, Reality's Tip on Earth Ministry. Our channels have been flagged by this Jezebel, an- another hog head cheese, this pork chop piece of trash, this Jezebel Napasha da. Yesterday, November the 28th, according to to YouTube information, she spent hours false flagging, making copyright claims on all our videos. She's reporting to YouTube that our material is hers. That's what she has done. She has false flag and claim maybe uh, 30, 40, 50 videos. That's what she has done. False flag into YouTube claiming that our material is hers. That's what she has done. So I don't want nobody to think that is Sister Noble or uh, Karen or even a Leo or any of these other people that uh, we've been having a dispute with, it's Napasha Da. This is a, and maybe she thought because she didn't false flag the videos where she was the topic, I guess she thought that we wouldn't know it's her. It's funny, she did not claim, as far as I can see, she didn't flag none of the videos where I was talking about her, none of them. I guess she assumed that we wouldn't know that it was her, that she can just false flag videos and we wouldn't know it's her because none of her videos was flagged. But that's not how YouTube works. You have to use the same email that's affiliated with your YouTube account. It's Naposha Da. It's Naposha Da. I don't have very much to say about this because that's how cowards roll. These are your pro-blacks. These are the ones who love us. These are the ones that care about the black people. They call you coon. They call you sambo. They call you nigger. They false flag your channels. They will spread gossip on you. And in some very extreme cases, they will murder you. This, this is this is their this is how they roll. Malcolm X is the most famous victim of pro-black murder. 
this is why I don't have nothing to do. And this is why I talk against Pan-Africanism, pro-blackness, and all this black scholarship. This is why I speak the way I speak about these, this mindset. These people mean us no good. They're nothing but pink races and brown skin. That's all they are. They're nothing but they're nothing but pink races and I'm not even gonna say white people. They are pink races with brown skin. Now, this woman claimed to be some kind of Hebrew Israelite, all that peace and love, and you see her on her videos and She's doing all this meditation. You see, none of it, none of it works for her. None of it works for her. I'm on Facebook with some people and they talking all that spiritual stuff. And I'm just making, making my points about the whole situation. You know, the spirit, spirituality, divine thing. And they start, they come back to me. with profanity and cussing. Now, the way this woman carries herself and these people that's so spiritual or whatever, these are some of the most nastiest, profane, vulgar, and chances are they suck penis, they eat vagina, they do the old doo-doo hole. This, they nasty and disgusting with their spiritual ass. All these frauds. This is why I speak the way I do. And the only thing they do, and the only thing she has done, is verify the things that I say. You have not hurt me because you was a piece of trash. Then, whether Angel Snub Nub 7 speak or not, you are a piece of trash. It doesn't make any difference. Sarnetta's platform is a piece of garbage, is a piece of trash, and all this pro-blackness, more science temple, all this stuff, Hebrew is all of it is garbage. It's fake. This here is a form of assassination. Like I told you. They physically murdered Malcolm X. And when you falsely cyber these copyright, knowing damn well it's false flagging. That's, that's assassination. Cyber assassination. You want me silent. And the killer thing is, at the same time, these people say, nobody listening to Angel Snub Nub 7. You say, I only have 10 subscribers, I only have 10 viewers, nobody listening to me, who cares? But you find that it's necessary to assassinate me. Thank you, Jamel. Why is that? Why is it necessary to assassinate Angel Snub Nub 7? It's because Angel Snub Nub 7 is because the reality is temple on earth. We are the truth. I didn't say me. <laughs> Jamel, I didn't say me. I said you. You and me. We are the real truth. We are the righteous. We are what you want to be, but can't be because you're too damn weak and, and, and you're too damn dumb. So there's a jealousy and there's an envy because we represent originality. We represent the new while y'all happy ass still trying to ride camels back in Egypt time. And what we do here, we deal with the present and we deal with the future. 
We have vision. We have a purpose. We have all the things that you claim, but you don't have. I want to thank Jamil for being with us this morning because I didn't really expect nobody to really be here. Um, riding with me on this live stream also is our brother Talib. And if you want to say a few things before we get out of here, uh, you certainly may. Yes, I'll let you, I'll let you finish saying what you got to say and then I'll chime in. Well, there's not really too much to say, except I just wanted to let the, let the audience know that we have been false flagged, channels been terminated because of false flagging by Nepal Shaddaa, this, this spiritual whore, because that's what she is. I didn't call her a whore. I call her a spiritual whore because she's willing to lay down with anybody that would give her a place to lay down. She has no scruples, no boundaries, no anything. This is, this is the most cowardly thing on YouTube that you can do. Most people would try to do this and they don't want you to know that they've done it. Because back in the day, you could... Uh, file copyright strikes and you could do all this flag people channels and YouTube wouldn't tell who it was but YouTube YouTube now tells you the the gives you the the uh, the email address and this email address is associated with Nepal Shada her YouTube account so we know that it's Nepal Shada it is not Sister Noble. It is not Aaliyah Muhammad. It is not Karen. It is not Guy Nollywood Jr. or Cool Cutter or, or Alquan. None of these people. YouTube tells me that Napasha Da yesterday flagged 30 or more of our videos, claiming our videos is hers. False flagging. That's what she done. This was so it was done on purpose. The most cowardly, nastiest thing that you could do on YouTube. This shows how weak she is. This is a weak, she's a weak person. This shows how weak you really are. A pathetic loser. Loser. Now, she I don't know why she chose us to use all her energy on because there's a lot of people out there that's sharing her uh, naked photographs. Well, lady, you just you just made yourself another a new enemy. I don't give a damn if it's a 15 minute video. You just made yourself a new enemy. And I don't never stop. Every time you turn around, you're going to have videos about your happy prostitute ass. You have nothing to offer. All that fake pseudo scholarship, Hebrew Israelite. See, this is another thing. There's bad and good in, 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 in all things. There are fake ass Christians. And you have Christians who are really trying to live a Christ-like life and they love Jesus and they act like they are peace lovers. This woman is a Hebrew Israelite and she's a fraud. This is not, she is, she is not exhibiting the behavior of Hebrew Israelites that I know of. Now I have a relative that is a Hebrew Israelite and he acts just like Nepal Shaddaa. Both of them are pieces of trash. Both of them are pieces of trash. I know good Hebrew Israelites. I know people who are actually striving to, to live a righteous life and all like that.
Yeah, it's Napashada. Napashada is the one flagged over 30 video last night. According to YouTube, she flagged maybe, you know, maybe, maybe 50 videos claiming that those video, our videos is hers. It's Napashada. No doubt. Now, unless YouTube is telling a lie or bringing a lie, I don't know. But according to YouTube information, it's Napashada. It's Napashada. So, I'm going to pass the mic over to uh, our brother. To live, let him speak, and we're gonna get out of here. I just want to let you know uh, why the, why you don't see those channels. It's because of the Pasha Dar false flag. Go ahead. Uh. Oh yes, this is uh, your brother Talib. Uh, yes, uh, and, and I'm glad to be on this panel. Uh, you know, to uh, be able to uh, comment in on this situation. But uh, I want to just say that, um, you know, a lot of people over the years have always talked about how much we don't have nothing but 10 to 5 subscribers. But yet, <laughs> what we say is so effective that they got to do college stuff like what she just did, you mm -hmm. know? But damn, we, we only got 10 subscribers, <laughs> so no one ain't really hearing what we got to say. Ain't nobody really listening to us. But obviously, for somebody like Nepal, uh, whatever her name is, mm -hmm. to do what she did, you know, evidently, what we saying from this platform is effective. I mean, that's just plain, clear cut, you know? I mean, how, how in the world is you going to sit up and say, we only got 10 subscribers and ain't nobody really listening to us, but our message is so powerful that you take hours to get channels took down. Hours. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, it's definitely got to be some effect coming from this platform, what, what we say. To make a person feel like they got to go through all the changes to do something like that, you know. So I mean, that's that's just my uh take on that situation, you know. Mm -hmm. But uh, you know, uh, I I really I really want to just say that, you know, um, like I reiterated before to the brother before we got on live, you know, my mother told me, may she rest in peace, she told me years ago when I was young that women are very devious and this situation even today, years later, decades later, confirmed what my mother said was true all along. You know what I'm saying? And I listen to other women talk about women. You know, women talk about other women as being vindictive. And I've been hearing this over the years, you know, and that's true. I mean, this is nothing, this is not to take no shots at the female uh, sex, but, you know, because I know all women are not conniving and devious and vindictive, you know, and and, 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 and got these uh, crazy, you know, vindictive agendas, but I have to say that for the women who do, who do this, they really give other women a bad name, mm -hmm. other women that are very uh, civil, you know, peaceful, loving, trying to live decent lives in the best manner that they can, trying to be the best humans that they can, they make these other females look bad when they do what they do. You know, and I'm 
not saying that men are not equivalent, don't do equivalent stuff to the evilness that women do. I'm not saying that at all. All I'm saying is, is that women have their own way of doing it, and the way that they do it is, huh, I mean, it's just crazy. You know? That's just like somebody said, you know, uh, uh, making a false charge against somebody to get somebody sent to jail for nothing, you know? Mm -hmm. And that's just not cool, you know, with what she did. You know, she got other people attacking her left and right on social media. She ain't done nothing to them like that, obviously. No. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, it's just crazy, you know, for this to go down the way it did. But, hey, you know, that's what comes along with telling the truth. Yes, you know? sir. Yes, sir. So, it is what it is, and we're going to keep telling the truth from this platform no matter what. That's right. So, you can keep on, you know, false flagging our channels or videos or whatever you you, you, you know, you're not going to stop this uh, mission from a uh, reality temple on Earth platform. You're not going to stop the mission of Operation Exodus Mississippi either, you know? So, I mean, you can keep doing whatever you feel like doing as far as trying to sabotage our platform. It's, it's simply not going to work. So, uh, I mean, you know, but she, she definitely is a coward. Yes, that's right. And, that's all I got to say for that. In, in peace. Yes, sir. Thanks for letting me uh, speak on this panel this morning. Yes, sir. And I want to thank you and I want to thank those in the chat room, those who will be listening and those who will be listening to this video later. Just wanted to come on here very shortly to let you know about uh, this cowardly action by a person affiliated with the House of Consciousness. And this is how they roll. Mind you, again, they don't take they didn't take this drastic action uh, against these other persons that actually have a lot of subscribers and, and whatever. They decided they decided to take uh, to flag us, the, the the little fella, the little fella, because I assume that we have the most power. We're the, we're the one that's actually the one that's that's spreading or, or bringing us uh, reality. We're, we're, we're actually the good guy. But again, we just wanted to come on here very short, let you know what's happening. Naposha Da. False flag our channels, but uh, this train, this train, yeah. For cutting you off, I, but, but I just wanted to say one more thing, and you could carry us on out of here. You know, I was watching another uh, video last night on this uh, particular uh, YouTube channel, which is one of those uh, pro black conscious platforms. And all them Negroes was talking about was nothing that's associated with black consciousness, nothing that's associated with black liberation, okay? And they be on there for hours talking the same stuff that don't have nothing at all to do with our liberation mm -hmm. struggle. Mm -hmm. And it just really made made it more confirming to me that I wasted all them damn years out of my life messing with this pro-black conscious stuff and I wish that I could go back in time and, and erase all that but I know that's not the reality No, that's why from this platform I will continue and we it's all well from this platform continue to help deter people from getting caught up in that pro-black conscious stuff because it's nothing but death. It's worse than death than Christianity. Mm -hmm. And with that said, uh, I'm going to uh, rest my mic. Peace. And with that said, we are Audi 5000, as Duncan Lillis used to always say as in parting. 
I wish us love, peace, and y'all stay safe out there. So, we out.